Greetings, Love Posse. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to our channel. Today's message, everything is a choice. Pay attention to the choices that you make. Use discernment. Be purposeful. Everything is a choice. Who are you going to spend your time with? Who are you going to share information with about your life, about yourself, about what you're doing? What are you putting into your body temple? What are you thinking? Everything is a choice. Will you accept that job offer? Will you work for yourself? What are you advocating for? What are you lending your support towards? Everything is a choice. Choose what's in your highest and best. Choose what's in the highest and best of everyone involved. Others Mother Earth, there's no time for this. I don't have a choice. <laughs> Some people believe they don't have choices. We all have choices. Even not making a choice is a choice, whether you are consciously aware of it or not, we, you are making choices, deciding to take one path over another. Our health is extremely important during this time. Are you going to eat that fast food? Are you going to eat food, dead food? that's not helping your body to function, that is not supporting your immune system, that is inviting in dis-ease? Are you going to choose more plant-based food? Live food for a live body that supports your immune system. It's choice. That friend who doesn't have your back, who's always telling you you can't do that, but you're still hanging on to that person. Are you going to continue to tell them your business knowing they're not supporting you? That's a choice. Are you going to continue to Hang on to people. Keep people in your life that are sucking you of your energy. Vampirism is huge now. People coming in, sucking you, sucking you of your energy, draining you of your vital life force. It's a choice. Are you going to continue to let them in? Take those phone calls knowing this is someone who sucks me of my energy, who wastes my time. Stress. Stress is a choice. Elizabeth Lesser refers to it as choice-based stress. We choose our stress. This job or that job, hanging around this person or that person, talking to this person or that person on the phone. <laughs> we choose our stress. This is not a time to choose stress at all. Hang back. Okay? Move slowly. Don't create stress for yourself by taking on too much work, too many tasks and activities. There's not a time to be arrogant, <laughs> thinking you can do everything. We can't. 
<laughs> Our bodies are fragile. <laughs> A lot of people are experiencing anxiety, overwhelm, doing too much. Learn your limitations right now. Again, learn what your limitations are. You can't take all these things on right now. We're going through evolutionary initiations. Everything is a choice. Love, Bossy. Choose well. Choose purposefully. Choose with discernment. Everything is a choice. Small choices, large choices, doesn't matter. It's going to affect the trajectory of your life. It's about you right now and the choices you make for your life because your choices will impact all of us. Everything is a choice. Choose wisely. Love, Posse. <sighs> Thank you for your time, Love, Posse. Please follow my other YouTube channel, Tiffany Howard Films, also on Vimeo as Tiffany Howard Films. Please check out my website, TiffanyHoward.love. It's all about love. Let's radiate love. Let's remain in the heart space of love and compassion and understanding and kindness, love posse. I have some virtual workshops coming up on Saturday, September 24th, The Art of Conscious Dying. You will love this workshop. It's experiential. We're going to do so many wonderful exercises, creative expression, expressive writing, uh, tapping, meditation, the art of conscious dying, September 24th. Check it out on my website. Also, between October and November, my five-session workshop, Feel and Heal, Exploring Our Feelings Through Creative Expression. I believe that begins mm, October 12th. Don't quote me on that. Check it out on my website. Also, beginning in January, my Women's Circle for Women 50 years of age are older, only 12 women. In that circle, we're going to explore Angelise Arian's book, The Second Half of Life. Check it out on my website, TiffanyHoward.love. Again, thank you for your time, Love Posse. I love you so much, Love Posse. So much, so much. Words cannot express how much I love you. The divine loves you. You are loved. Namaste. Namaste.